So the game I'm playing today is called Ink. This is an interesting little indie game that came out a couple years ago. It's a pixelated platformer in which you play as a white square, and all of the stages are invisible. However, every time you jump, your square shoots out ink, and using your ink, you can color all of the platforms in order to find your way to the end of the stage. The game is kind of trial and error, because since the stages are invisible, obviously you don't know where all the platforms are, However, when you die, your ink doesn't get erased, so you can restart the stage, but all your ink will still be there, so you'll still be able to find your way to the end. And I just wanted to play this because it looked really cool, and actually, I did find out about this game shortly after it was released back in 2015, but I kind of overlooked it at first, and to be honest, I don't really have an excuse for overlooking this game. I mean, I just looked at it, and I thought, yeah, this looks pretty cool, but then I just forgot about it after that, because my short-term memory is horrendous. But I really did want to play this game, and since I honestly can't think of any newer games to play, I decided, yeah, why not, let's go and play Ink. But I have wanted to play this game for quite some time, because it does look pretty cool. It kind of reminds me of Super Meat Boy, except it's more colorful and vibrant, and not as bone-crushingly difficult as far as I'm aware. I don't know that for sure, though, because I haven't played the game off-screen at all. So, how's about I stop talking and just play the game here? So we'll press enter, so we have level select, and it seems like we can't go to the other levels, we can only go to level 1. So I guess we'll just go to level 1 then. I have no idea how many levels there actually are in this game, but I think there is supposed to be, uh, more than 50 levels, so... I'm probably not gonna play through the entire game in this video, because that's just gonna take way too long. So you can press the arrow keys, or A and D to move, or the left and right arrow keys. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. So yeah, as I move along, I, uh, I create color. Um, uh, okay, there's just an invisible wall over here. Yeah, and also, just like, uh, Super Meat Boy, I can actually jump off walls. I can just- I can just spray ink all over the place here. Okay, yeah, so when I double jump, that's- that's when all the ink goes flying, okay. So that's just a tutorial right there. Uh, press spacebar and A to jump. Okay, is there a place where I have to jump here? Okay, so I could also use this double jump to, to shoot ink everywhere. Alrighty then. I don't know if I jumped over a gap there, but... Press space and A in the air to jump again. Oh jeez. Okay, well, I just died. Achievement unlocked. Ink introduction. Alright, I got an achievement for dying. It's gonna be another one of those games where the achievements are, like, super easy to get. Tutorial text. RE wall jump. What? Tutorial text? RE wall jump? Um... Is it supposed to say that, or did the game glitch out and it just displayed that instead? I have no idea, but it's just saying that I can wall jump. So, I- I already know. I already know how to wall jump, just get up to a wall. I can also slide down a wall, and that creates ink as well. So yeah, it seems like I just need to find my path, and I can just- I can just blast all the walls with ink in order to find my way out of here. Okay, it looks like I can, uh... I can go up this way. Yeah, alright. So I can probably wall jump up here and just jump all the way to the exit. Yeah, there we go. Alright, and the exit's up there now. Okay, I just- I just died. Yeah, so like I said, it- it is kind of trial and error because you don't actually know where any of the, uh, any of the platforms are, but it does look like there is a wall that we can jump up right here. Oh, okay, that's just a tiny little square. Hang on a second. There's another wall that we need to jump on. Yeah, so I have- I have no idea how difficult this game actually is, but... It's probably not gonna be that hard at first. I don't know about the later levels, though. Okay, there's a wall that we can just- just slide down here. Alright, and, uh, I don't know where exactly I'm going. Okay, hang on a second. It seems like I can just jump over that wall. Okay, I was- I was thinking that I might be able to make it to this wall. Oh, and I was able to. Okay, I have no idea where I'm even going, but I just got to the exit. Alright, so where do I go here? Okay, that's- that's just a gap. Okay, there's a little square that I can jump on right here. Hang on a second. Let me blast some ink over in this direction. Because I can land on here, and then I can land on this square. And there's a square over there, and just get to the exit. Okay, apparently going off the screen also also kills me. Like, going off the edges of the screen. Alright, so at, at least all my ink stays here. At least at least it doesn't get erased, which I already knew it it didn't do that. Okay, so what what now? Okay, I- I do see a platform that I can- that I can land on. Incompetent. Really, is- is- that- you're calling me incompetent because I- I- I died a whole bunch? Holy jeez, game. You're- you're already going hard on me already, and I just- I just began this. Alrighty then, uh, what else do we have here? I mean, it, it's not really my fault that I'm dying, I mean, I can't see the platforms. 
This is pretty much trial and error, because I don't know where the heck I'm supposed to go exactly. Alright, I guess I'll just, I'll just, I'll, I'll just, I'll just go down over here for now. Yeah, I can go over to, uh, this wall over here. Okay, is there a part of this that I can land on? Yeah, right over here. I need to go down this wall and then just get to the exit, alright. That ain't so bad right now, okay? And these little blocks right here are creating some ink. Okay, and I can destroy them by, by landing on them. Okay, then. Yeah, so they're kind of like Goombas. Oh, alright, and that unlocks the exit, actually. Alright, so I guess there are enemies in this game. Wow, of course. I just have to go in and slide off the... Oh my god, don't, don't you juke me. Don't you juke me, boy. Yes, I just have to go and slide off the 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 platform and die. I have to do this all over again, but it doesn't matter. We got through it. Oh, jeez. Okay, there's a bunch of them over here. Actually, this doesn't look too bad. This doesn't look too bad because I already I already see the path, the path that'll lead me to victory. Okay. Now I'm assuming that these things can actually kill me, so I should probably be careful here. I should just be a little bit careful, but they can be destroyed pretty easily it seems, and then just fall towards the exit. Oh jeez, okay, they're all on the sides of me. Actually, this shouldn't be so bad, because I can just... I can just fall on them and they all die. And I also have another new item in my inventory, which is probably a trading card that I don't care for. Whatsoever. Just like every, every single Steam game in existence. Alright, now I just need to go and get up on this, this square right here, if I possibly can. And... Oh, okay. I don't know what the heck I collected there, but looked like some sort of heart. Okay, I checked really quickly just to see what level we're on, and we're already on level 14 here, guys. Oh, jeez, okay. Um, the screen's actually moving, so I guess this is a much, a much larger level here. Alright, well, I already know where the, uh, the end platform is. Okay, so I can go in here to, uh, destroy this guy. Okay, and then just get up here and destroy you. Or not, I'll just go off the screen and, and, and I'll die. Alright, I don't understand why the why the edges of the screen destroy me. It's like if I just go slightly off the edge, then I die. I don't really understand that. Alright. Well, at least I know where all the platforms are. Now I just need to get over to uh to these guys over here and just destroy them. There we go. You're done. And uh who should I go for first? Maybe I'll maybe I'll go for you here. There we go, you're dead. And just go down here and destroy this guy. There we go. And now all we have to do is get to the exit if I don't die. There we go, I didn't die. I didn't die. And, uh, okay, where where exactly is the exit? Well, I do see another one of these these heart things up here. Hang on a second. Yeah, that looks like some sort of some sort of coin. Hang on, can I... Is there a way that I could possibly get that? Hang on a second, let me go and shoot shoot some ink over here. Um, okay. Is, is there any way I can even reach that? Is there some sort of wall that I can, that I can jump up? I guess, I guess there isn't, but, uh, okay, well, I guess I probably need that for maybe 100% completion, but, nah, I don't, I don't really care about 100% completion here, let's just go to the, uh, we'll probably just try to get to the end of the stages instead of, instead of trying to 100% this game here, guys. Alright, well, I'm hearing, I'm hearing some noises, so I'm thinking there might be some enemies somewhere. Okay, yeah, they're apparently all the way up here, I guess, and... Holy geez. Yeah, one th one thing that I should... That I noticed about this game, or at least about its controls, is that... This this cube that I'm controlling seems to be, like, very slippery, for goodness sakes. Like, it's just just slips and slides all over the place, and it's kind of... Kind of hard to control. Okay, let me just try getting up here. Actually, there are no enemies. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just... I'll just... We'll just... I... Oh my god, why can I not speak correctly? I'm trying to get up this cube. The square... It's, that's the 2D object, not a 3D one. What, what am I even doing? Okay, there's just a wall right here. Alright, well, this doesn't look too bad. Okay, I just destroyed you. Oh, jeez. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. There we go. You're dead as well. And then you're gonna die, my good sir. There we go. And then we're just gonna slide down over here and get to the exit. That wasn't too bad. Alright. Just looks like there's only two guys right here. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad then. Just destroy you. But where's the exit, though? Oh, it's down over this way. Oh, okay, I see it. I see the exit. All right, well, in that case, destroy you, and then destroy you. Okay, very nice indeed. Then we'll just slide down over here and do it again. There we go. There's some precision platforming right here. Very nice indeed. Then we'll slide down, get to this cube, kill you. Okay, then. Oh, jeez, just be steady with this. Be steady with this. Very nice indeed. All right, no enemies here. But I don't see which platforms I have to jump to. 
Unless there's a platform I have to... Okay, there's one over the... One over here. Okay. And then we jump across? Okay, yeah, there's... There's actually some enemies up this way. Or one enemy. Um... Okay, there's actually... There's actually two of them. Okay, so if I hit the sides of them, then... Then they kill me. Oh my god, if I can just... If I can just stop being terrible at platforming, I can try and, and do this. Okay, just stay there. Just jump across. Jump across right here. Try and kill this guy. Very nice indeed. And then kill the other guy. Alright, very good. Alright, just stop moving all over the place, then just get to the exit. Alright, very good indeed. Very nice indeed. And actually, what, what level are we at, just out of curiosity? Already at level 20, okay. Well, like I said, I don't know how many levels there are in this game. But, uh, we'll just keep playing for now, because I still feel like this video is- is still way too short. Alright, so these guys shouldn't be too hard. Of course, right when I say that, I- I- I die. Because I- I overshot him and- Oh my god, you know what? I'm just gonna just shut up. Because every time I open my big mouth, I always jinx everything that I say. So, you know what? Just- just stop. Just stop talking, even though- that's not really the point of a of a let's play video. You have to keep constantly talking and, and being annoying when you're when you're making these kinds of videos, but whatever. Just kill these guys. We'll just pick them off one by one. Okay. I thought I was going to die there, but I guess I can kind of jump on on the side of them. All right. All the guys on the bottom platform have been taken care of. Now we'll just move to the top over here. Actually, I think I'm going to go this way if I can actually hit this this cube right here. There we go. Hit this guy. Very nice indeed. Alright, what are the odds that I'm gonna- I'm gonna die on this guy while trying to destroy him? Okay, never mind, I didn't. Alright, very good. Now, if only I could- Oh my god, dude. If only I can get to this cube up here. There we go. Very good. Okay, only two of you guys? Well, I can destroy you first. And then I can destroy you second. Very good. And, uh, okay, well, where else do I go now? Because I don't really know. I guess I can go up this way. Yeah, I have to just keep climbing, I guess. Okay, can I... Do I not have... Can I not jump high enough in order to get to that platform right there? Yeah, because there is another cube. Oh, no, I can. I just suck at platforming. Oh, my goodness gracious. Yeah, these controls, they're so... They're so sensitive, I find. This is, this is ridiculous. Okay, a mountain of things. And I just- I just got killed, because of course I did. Oh my god, dude. Just- just die, please. Okay. Just- just be patient with this, okay? Just pick them off one by one. There we go. Just get rid of that guy. And then we can just fall down on the other ones. One, two, and three. There, very nice. Get that combo going. Very good. Alright, let's just keep going. Only two guys right here? Hopefully there's only two. Well, actually, this is a much larger level, so there's probably gonna be more. Yeah, there's... One other guy over this way. Okay, so how do I get to the other guy on top then? Um, oh, probably by using the platform over here. Yeah, I definitely could. And also using this wall. Okay, this shouldn't be... Actually, hang on a second. This wall isn't... Oh, okay, so if I jump off the screen, that also kills me. Holy crap, okay. Fine. Even if it's a gameplay mechanic that I don't exactly understand, I'll roll with it anyway. Can I, can I jump up this way? Oh my god, dude. I cannot land on any of these platforms. I guess I could go this way as well. Yeah. Alternate path discovered. Very nice indeed. Alright. Now we just need to get back over here. Just wall jump. Try not to hit the top of the screen because that kills me too for some reason. There we go. Just ground pound you into oblivion. Okay. Oh wait, I see a coin. I see another coin that I'm gonna go for. Yeah, there we go. I got it. Okay, I killed another guy. And yeah, the uh, the exit is down over, over this way. Okay. I, I don't think I even double jump there, even though I'm pretty sure I pressed the up arrow twice. There we go, you're done. Now we just gotta get back up here, if I can, and kill this other guy. Hang on, I'm gonna go to this, the top of this cube, just to ensure that I don't die from this. And then I could probably just fall towards the exit, but... You know what, screw it, I'm gonna play it safe. Well, I wasn't exactly playing it safe there, but I still made it, so... Alright, we're currently on level 24. Let's go in, kill this guy. Very nice indeed. Okay, there's clearly no... No platform I can land on right there. There's like a... Wow, a very tiny cube that I can land on right here, though. And try and kill this guy. There we go. And just keep going upwards. Okay, now I'm gonna have to go to... To you guys. Okay, the exit is right up there. Yeah, there is another cube that I can hit. Actually, I see another coin down there as well, but... Yeah, I don't think I'm going for that. Not today. I do not feel like it. 
I just don't feel like it. I just feel like completing these levels here. Stage 25? What the heck is this? Is this a boss? Uh... Yeah, I guess this is a boss here. Okay, I didn't know there were bosses in this game. Holy crap, you're creating, like, like spikes of colors. Color spikes. Okay, come on. Come on down. Come on down. You're on the prices right. Okay. Just wait for him to fall, and then jump over his spikes, and then kill him. Okay. I don't know how many hits this guy takes exactly. Oh, that's it. Ink Justice! Oh my god, we're, like, exploding here. Well, that was spectacular. <laughs> Okay, well that was a pretty easy boss fight, and uh, wait, the exit's right there. Oh, it's gonna introduce spikes now. Oh, I see, I see. So this is gonna be even more trial and error nonsense, because I mean, I can't see the spikes until it's too late. Okay, maybe there's another way I can go, I can go around this. Maybe I can jump over the spikes. Actually, jump in between it. Yeah, that's even, that's even better, actually. Alright, uh, spikes right there. Are there spikes right there? Okay, yeah, I, I see them. I do see the spikes. And then there's... I can't tell what this is over here. Okay, those are more spikes. Uh, can I go in between? Okay, yeah, I can. And I can't... Okay, there's spikes all over that wall. So I think I'll jump on this side right here. Yeah, then I can just jump over this to get to the exit. There we go. Nailed it. All right. Now I can just go down here... Oh, jeez, okay, we're gonna have some precision platforming. Precision! Oh, look at that, precision. Very nice indeed. Uh, oh, jeez, more precision? Or more spikes? Well, there's spikes on that, that bottom part right there. Okay, well, there's also spikes on the other part, too. Okay, hang on a second. Can I just, like, like, cheese this if I possibly can? Like, go down here and then just jump? Oh, my God. Well, I can't do it if I'm, like, screwing it up like that. Hang on a second. Let's use some speedrunning strats right here. Okay, the speedrunning strats are really not working right now. There we go. There's some speedrunning strats right there. Okay, so now we have to try and go through this gap. Oh, I probably could have... I probably could have went there. Okay, there we go. I somehow made it through. Now, can I go to the top? Okay, there's... there's nothing at the top. So I just need to go down. How did I... Really, I jumped to the left and I ended up hitting the spikes again. Are you serious? There we go, I made it through that time. Alright, are there no other spikes? No, there isn't. Okay, very nice. Now it's gonna start throwing enemies at me. Alright. Oh, and there's there's spikes all across these these little platforms as well. Okay, well, I have to go down here and kill you. So, oh jeez. Well, hang on a second. Did I get a coin? I heard the little jingle. Okay, I guess there was a coin down there as well. And, uh, go through the gap. Okay, I somehow got through the gap. Alright. Yeah, this is this is probably gonna get in incredibly difficult now, guys, because now I need to avoid the spikes, and I need to go in between spikes. I mean, I guess this really isn't that bad. Oh, and the coin I got also resets. Well, screw you, because I'm not going back to get you. So, you can just stay down in that pit. Oh my god, how do I keep dying here? I'm sorry, guys, but I don't have the patience for, for things like this. This is this is what I was worried about. This This game is going to get incredibly difficult, isn't it? I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to pull off some- some sick jumps right here. Well, I mean, that it, well, that was kind of a sick jump, I will- I will admit. But it's like, I have to perform these very- these very tricky precision jumps right here, that I'm absolutely horrendous at in video games. There we go, got through that time. That wasn't actually- that actually wasn't that bad. Now, just out of curiosity, what level am I on? Okay, we're already at level 30. Well, you know what, guys? Since I have been recording for a little while, I think maybe I'll, uh... I'll- I'll try to beat just this level, and then I think I'll stop. Because I think I've been recording for at least 20 minutes now, almost half an hour, so... I think the last level we'll complete in this video is level 30, and then we'll, uh, I don't know, maybe save the other levels for the next part? I mean, this game is starting to get pretty difficult now, but I'm still having a lot of fun, so I mean, I don't know, maybe I'll make more videos of this. Now, the only thing is that I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Oh, I'm supposed to go down over here and kill you guys. Oh, I see. I see. Do I need to go down even further, though? Uh, well, it doesn't look like I, I have to. Or, or do I? I don't know, do I have to work my way back up? Yeah, this is the bottom of the level, actually, so... Yeah, I guess- I guess I do have to work my way back up, okay. Well, wait. How exactly am I gonna do that? Because there's spikes here, which I could probably avoid if I- if I try hitting the sides, but... Okay. Um... I'm a little bit confused here, but hang on a second. Maybe I could figure this out. Maybe I do just need to go back up and just try and avoid the spikes. Well, I don't know how I'd be able to avoid the spikes like that. Okay, and I completely overshot this platform right here. Okay, hang on a second, guys. 
I'm gonna try and figure this out. I have to go back up the castle. Uh, scale the castle walls again. Okay, maybe this is precision. Maybe I have to hit that side right there without actually hitting the spikes. Or something like that. I have no idea what is even going on anymore. Yeah, there's like a little part that uh, I can hit without without dying, it seems. There we go. Just don't stop for anything. Just just keep going. Just keep going. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. I nailed it. I absolutely nailed it. Hopefully I can nail this. Alrighty then. Well, uh, well, just out of curiosity, what exactly is this level all about? I don't know where the exit is, but I can land on this. Yeah, and there is more level down over here. Oh my god, there's like four different guys. Actually, it just kind of looks like this is the same level, but with, with more spikes. So, actually, this one might even not be that complicated, because it seems like I can go down here and just avoid the the spike block right there, and just go back over this way, and then land on this guy, and then go through this little cube right here, and then get to the exit. Yeah, that's actually not that bad. Okay, and there's, there's no enemies here, but... Okay, the walls are closing in on me. Oh wait, do I just need to climb to the top? Oh, I guess I did just need to climb to the top, okay. And why are these walls moving now? Oh, okay, because the blocks are moving. Alright, well I'm hitting these guys from the side now, so... Why, why is that suddenly counting? Because the last time I tried doing that, they killed me. Okay, hang on a second. Let me try and restart this, because for whatever reason, I couldn't get up to the uh, to the other block here, even though I was trying. Okay, jump. Kill you. And then that's the end of the level. Okay, well, I'm suddenly starting to beat these levels a lot quicker now. Oh my god. Do I need to do this again? But then just get to the top again? What the heck is this? Gotta gotta avoid the, the scary walls that are closing in on me here. Okay, then. Um, alright, well, what level are we on now, guys? Because I really would just like to end the video. Okay, level 35. I think we will just stop here. Alright, well, that was Ink, guys. So, it does seem like there's a bunch of other levels that uh, we need to complete here. I'm not sure if I am going to uh, revisit this game, but maybe I will to try and uh, complete some of the other levels in it. So, maybe there will be a second part to this. Maybe I will try to do a full playthrough of this game, but... I have no idea how many levels there are exactly, but they are starting to get, uh, kind of difficult now. But I am going to try and beat the other levels, so there will probably be a second video of this. Maybe a third? I have no idea. I mean, it depends on how many levels there actually are. I don't know when this ends. Maybe this ends at level 100, so I could probably make, like, at least three or four videos of this before I reach the end. So, I'm still not really sure if I like this game or not, guys. I mean, I definitely like the, uh, the game's art style, and I mean, the music is, is great as well. I really do love this, this title screen music right here. But I mean, I'm not exactly a fan of these kinds of platformers. I mean, one of the reasons why I don't really like Super Meat Boy is because it's very difficult. And I mean, this game pretty much has the exact same gameplay or similar gameplay to Super Meat Boy. And in the later levels, it also seems to have similar difficulty. And to be honest, I, I don't exactly like the fact that all of the stages are invisible until you cover them in ink. Because if they're gonna throw spikes into the mix, then the game pretty much becomes trial and error at that point, because, I mean, I can't tell where the spikes are unless I can, uh, I shoot ink at them at first. And I know I can shoot ink by double jumping, but, I mean, the ink only flies so far. Like, I would rather not have a situation occur in which I'm very close to completing the stage, but then I run into a spike that I didn't see because I didn't cover it in ink, and then I have to go back to the very beginning and complete the level all over again. I mean, I do like the fact that it doesn't erase your ink when you restart the level, but still, it seems kind of of kind of unfair in a way like if I'm sliding down a wall and then suddenly I hit a pair of spikes that I didn't see not to mention the controls being kind of sensitive at least I feel they're sensitive I feel like just by simply tapping the arrow keys my my square moves so fast that I can't I can't really react to it in time but complaints aside I still like this game but it kind of borders on I like this game and also this is not the game for me like it's it's like on the very edge of that kind of kind of crossing the line a little bit. Well, it's not really crossing the line, but it's pretty much residing on the line. But other than that, guys, I'll probably revisit this game and try to beat the other levels, so there will probably be more videos of this. If you want to purchase this game and play it for yourself, the link is in the description. But I'm just gonna stop here for now, guys. So, as always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video I make. Later!